morning <laughs> morning guys today is saturday um yesterday i really didn't vlog i just went to work there was nothing really special that happened yesterday i went to work and then i came home so today is saturday um i just woke up and i made breakfast i'll show you guys what i made um, so today I'm not sure exactly like what's gonna happen um, but I am gonna go to a Chinese shop um, to get some few things for the house so I'm gonna take you guys with me and then I'm gonna come home and set up whatever that I will get there hopefully I get like some nice things because I need some things for the bathroom like this is not it i need a nice toilet brush toilet paste thing holder that's gonna sit there um i also need that um cutlery divider thing organized i don't know what you call it but i need that i need a couple of things so um we're gonna go and check it out and then yeah come back home and set it up so um let us do that but before we do that let me show you guys what i made for breakfast so this is what we have for breakfast i think the lighting is a bit too much but we have eggs apple bacon and pancakes so that's for breakfast and then we're gonna have some cool drink with that i thought i'd actually have like um i'd have lemon water but i'm gonna have cool drink with that and then guys i made these lemon sugar cookies they are absolutely delicious okay they are amazing and then I'd like to warm them up for like 30 seconds in the micro, in the microwave. I almost said macro oven, <laughs> microwave. Just for like 30 seconds, they become like really soft and gooey and delicious. So I like to have these with um, tea with no sugar because they are really sweet. So I just keep them in this jam jar. I don't know what you call this actually, but yeah i kept them in here so let's have breakfast and then we're gonna shower and then after we shower we're gonna head out to the chinese shop let's do that hey guys so just came back from the chinese shop and i know i did say i was gonna take you guys with me but i know i said i was gonna take you guys with me but i couldn't like vlog to be honest it was a very shady neighborhood and i didn't like have the time to like vlog and show you guys how it looked but i will be going back again so trust and believe when i go back again i'm gonna take you guys with me but anyways, I wanted to show you what I got in here. So, $5.63, that's how much everything costs. So the first thing I got was this. It was 10 Rand. So this I'm gonna use in the bathroom for the toothbrush and the toothpaste because I showed you guys that mug that I hate. It's hideous. I don't like it. So I thought this was cute. So I'm gonna use this. And I'm going for like a white and gray color scheme thing thing going on in the bathroom so 
I'm trying to play around with like whites and grays. The reason why is because my shower is gray, but the walls are white. My basin and toilets are white. And then my washing machine is gray. So it only makes sense to like play around between white and gray, you know? And then the second thing that I got was this. Um, it's a plastic cutlery tray, it's transparent, which is great. Um, this was 60 Rand. So I've been wanting this for a very long time uh, because my knives and spoons and stuff are just not in order. So I'm glad I got this to help organize that section. Another thing that I've always needed is a sieve. Um, I think this was like 15 Rand or something. Let me see. Oh no, it doesn't show here. But I think this was like 15 Rand, if I'm not mistaken. So this I'm going to use for like when I serve my ingredients, when I'm cooking or when I'm baking. And then the other thing that I got, which I ran out was um cling wrap and then i also wanted to get um non-stick baking paper for when i bake because sometimes my stuff gets like it, it sticks to the, um, the oven pan so yeah so this was how much was this this was 20 rand this was 16 rand this is the clean wrap because i've run out of clean wrap i use it quite a lot so i needed to get that and then i just got um toothbrush i got these um sponges these were like 12 rand and it's one two three four five I just hope that like I mean it's tough right I'm not expecting them to be like last forever you know but I just hope they are like okay if you get what I'm saying and then I got this um, I don't know what you call this it's that um, it's a brush thing that you can use when you like brush your things on top you know even your meat yeah i wanted a wooden one but i didn't find a wooden one so this was closest to like wood i don't know <laughs> but i wanted a wooden one and i couldn't get it so this is like beige ish so Cause in the kitchen i'm going for like a black white brown and in this case the brown would be the wood feel and then i got this rolling pin um i have been needing a rolling pin for the longest time and i didn't get a big one guys i really got like a nice portable small one this was 25 rand because I just need to roll out my things and I mean when I bake I don't really make big quantities of like whatever that I make so this is okay for me this this size this is really cute I like that and then I got a kitchen rack kitchen towel this was 20 rand and this is just batteries for a mouse and then again we're trying to keep that white in the bathroom so I got this um, soap tray thing which I really like did it come off Okay, no, it doesn't come off, but it's fine. 
So I got this soap tray, just white. That was 28 Rand. And then I got this like wooden spoon thing because currently I only have one wooden spoon which I use quite a lot and I use it for like when I make up and stuff like that so I feel like I've overused it and I wanted to get more um, wooden spoons and I've been wanting something like this that also comes with like a holder thing so I'm really happy that I got this as well so this was I think this is the most expensive thing that I got this is 40 rand so I'm gonna put this next to my um I'm gonna put this next to my chopping board because it's also like wood ish not wood ish it's wood <laughs> so I'm gonna put this there try to make it cute yeah so this is what I got and then um also got this storage wardrobe thing can you see i'm going to be having a visitor coming to the house so we got this and then um, i'm just going to put it by the bathroom i have like a wall there that's like open and stuff the reason why I've got a portable one was because um, in case we don't use it anymore and then we can just like look like a bird <laughs> it's a bear <laughs> does it not look like a bird oh my gosh creepy okay guys so I'm about to give up well I'm not giving up I'm just taking a break because I'm trying to like figure this thing out I think I'm gonna watch like a YouTube video but this is like how far we are so we have like this one shelf done here's the second shelf and then here's the third shelf and then the fourth shelf is like up here so let me take this back so that you guys can see properly. So this is what we have, right? And then I put this long one here. I put this long one here, but I can't figure out as to, is it supposed to be here? You see? So, I'm just gonna leave it here I'm gonna leave everything as is I'm leaving everything as is I'm gonna go take a shower relax a little bit and then once I've re 
cooked, whatever. I'll come back again. But I wanted to see how uh, <laughs> what color is this? Oh my gosh. It looks like some sort of a green. I thought it was gonna be grey, but it looks gray. well it looks grey on like here, but it's green. It's like a very light military green. Crazy. But yeah. Let's go shower. You better on the first date I should've said what's wrong in the first place I don't cause you always taking it the wrong way You won't listen, you're too busy playing 2K I've always been down but you still sleep and even though I said it now you should've been peed I feel it in my soul, yeah, so deep So deep, you should know that about me yeah. I just turned, just turned down your avenue I had to, but I'm mad at you Always say I got an attitude, oh yeah. But that's you, you was acting rude I had to ask you if you had a few Cause you always say I got an attitude, oh Why you talking to me like you be like Why you always wanna be right Oh, I just need the time that you came from I just need to know that it's still mine and the way that you can't say my name don't seem right But I know when to go and to stop at the green light Oh, I just turned, just turned down your avenue I had to, but I'm mad at you, yeah You always say I got an attitude, oh Yeah, but that's you, you was acting rude I had to ask you if you had a few Always say I got an attitude Guys So I'm in the car I finished showering and everything And then I get A call From my sister Saying she has Touched down in Cape Town so the last time when she was here i didn't get to see her so i'm on my way now to go see her um i really miss her so much i haven't seen her in a while um so yeah we're gonna go see her see how she's doing and spend some time with her tomorrow i want to go to church so idiot are you an idiot aren't you driving like an idiot it's kids like oh my gosh you know these kids that borrow their parents cars and they'll be driving like maniacs Oh my gosh, so unnecessary. Anyways, so I'm going to see my sister now. Um, and then I did take some clothes for sleeping over. Um, so yeah, that's what we'll do. Oh my god, this guy is driving like, <sighs> and you can see with the way he's like sitting, he's like sitting like this. And he looks like a child. Anyways, thank God he's not my child. <laughs> but anyways, let me drive, guys. I'll talk to you when I get to the house. Oh.
guys so I'm driving past Century City right and I just had I just felt like having a moment of gratitude because I look at my life and don't get me wrong there's problems these issues these challenges there's a lot of things you know but I look at my life now and last year this time I was in bloom in my mother's house you know and it was beautiful but I knew that I wanted to move and I wanted more for my life and more for myself and as I'm driving here past um, Century City, looking at the beautiful buildings, you know, I'm just so thankful and so grateful because I feel like I live in Cape Town. You know, this is one of the places that I told myself that one day when I retire, if I had to retire in South Africa, I want to live in Cape Town. <laughs> I want to retire in Cape Town, you know. So, for me to live here, and mind you, I'm 29 years old. I'm 29, I'm turning 30 this year. And I'm already living here. This already tells me that God's plans may not be the plans that we have for our lives. And I'm just... I just had a moment of gratitude you know because i'm like i'm 29 i'm in one of the most beautiful relationships that i've ever dreamed of in my life you know um my family is it's okay everyone is healthy everyone is alive you know i'm driving my own car i have a house where i stay in even though <laughs> i'm renting you know, but I have a house, I have a roof over my head, and I'm just so grateful. I'm just so grateful. I work in one of the greatest, if I should say, marketing and branding companies in Cape Town who deals with like a lot of brands. You know, I work on the second biggest brand. Um, so I wanted to say which bread it is. <laughs> I almost said it. Should I just say it? Okay, fine. I think I'll say it because you guys don't actually know where I work, but it doesn't matter. It's not a secret. I work with FMB, which is one of the best friends that I've ever worked with, you know, and yeah i'm just i'm just so grateful i don't want to lie to you guys i'm just so grateful and you know i have problems i have issues in my life but i feel like it's just always important to have that moment of gratitude just for the little that you have and just say thank you god for 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 this thank you for trusting me with this you know one thing we definitely know is that we ain't retiring in Cape Town no more, honey. <laughs> we are not retiring in Cape Town anymore. We have to go overseas or something. We're not going to retire here, chill. <laughs> but because we already live here. You see, it, it wouldn't make sense to like retire here because I already live here. <laughs> but anyways, guys, yeah, I just had that moment of like gratitude. You know, I'm just so blessed. I'm so grateful, you know. So, yeah, that's that. <laughs>
Yeah, yeah, this is nice. Mm. Yeah, this is nice. Mm. This is nice. Mm. Mm. Yeah, this is nice. Mm. 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 Yeah, this is nice. Mm. Mm. Yeah, this is nice. Mm. 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 Good morning. <laughs> Good morning, guys. Good morning. I hope you guys are well. The lighting is not the greatest. Oh my gosh. Um, and okay, let me do that. Morning. <laughs> I just woke up, guys. I just woke up. My hair is a mess. I need to undo this hair and like redo my hair. Good morning. Um, it is Sunday today. Can I put you guys somewhere? Can I put you guys here? Oh. It is Sunday today. It's a Sunday morning. I'm gonna put you guys there. Morning. Sunday. <laughs> today is Sunday, guys. I slept at my sister's house because it was so late for me to go home. So I slept here. Um so I think yesterday, the last time we saw each other was at the mall, when we went to the mall. Um, after that, we went to fetch my niece at her friend's house. So I didn't vlog that part because of privacy and, you know, and it's the first time I went there. So it didn't make sense to like vlog and stuff, you know, especially when you go to people's houses. Um, ideally, you don't vlog in people's houses unless you ask for permission and then they give you the permission to vlog in the houses but anyways today is sunday morning um i will be going back to my house um so now i'm gonna shower we're gonna shower and then we're gonna head out with my sister and my niece to get breakfast and then i think after that we're gonna go drop her off at school um because she's a boarder and then my sister will be heading back to Lesotho. Um, her flight is at 5, so she has to leave by 4 at least. But it's Sunday, so I don't think there is like um, traffic or anything like that. So yeah, so I'm going to shower now, get ready. And mind you guys, I don't have clothes. <laughs> I do not have clothes in a sense of I bought a dress. I was supposed to go to church today. I was supposed to go to church today, but the girl was like, no way, I cannot. <laughs> I woke up so tired. Um, so I have a church dress, <laughs> but I think I'm not going to wear that. I'm going to wear like the stuff that I wore yesterday when I was with my sister. I think I'm just going to wear the stuff that I wore yesterday. Because I don't want to be wearing like a dress and stuff. I want to be comfortable. Anyways, let us get clean. Let us shower. And yeah, I'll see you guys when I'm done. Um, and then we're going to head out and grab something to eat.
I like your outfit. Tell us where did you get your outfit? No, Give us an outfit on. check. Huh? Okay. Let's start with the shoes. Birkenstocks. Birkins. Birkin what? Birkenstocks. Birkenstocks. That's the Birkin. Okay. Nike socks. Nike socks. Okay. The this shorts. A cotton on. This is from Cotton On. <laughs> this thing is from Cotton On. Yeah. Oh my gosh. And then this is. I don't know about this one. Okay. And it's just the hair tie. Hair tie. <laughs> All right. Forward. Check, check. Okay, we now see you. We see you. Hey guys. So we are at. What's this place? Is he point or Camps Bay? Yeah. Yeah. Um, we're going to the nines. I'll show you guys now. I feel so underdressed because I'm wearing like I gotta get to a Jimmy or something, which is crazy. But yeah. So let's go. <laughs> It was really nice. Had a nice meal, ma'am. Hi. So Tell them to follow you on Instagram. Give you your handle, okay. but I'll put it somewhere as well yeah. down there. It's Pookie four four four. Pookie four four four. Like, follow, subscribe, share <laughs> yeah. everything. Her Insta handle is Pookie four four four. So it's Pookie triple four. She's a biker chick. So, this is the end of the vlog. Um, I hope you guys really liked it. Do also to make sure to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. 
Uh, we're on the road to 400 subscribers, so that is great. That's nice. So do the Lord's work. Subscribe. It doesn't cost anything to subscribe, guys. It's free. <laughs> so yeah. Thank you so much. I'll see you on the next vlog.